Hi, Nicole here. I recently posted a video of me in a, my home studio taking photos of products, and I had a question on how my images were instantly popping up in Lightroom, which I use a tether cord, and someone asked me if I could show them how I do this. So I have a Canon 5D Mark IV, and when I upgraded to this camera, I also had to upgrade my tether cord. So I found this one on Amazon, but there are a lot of great cords out there. You can go on Tether Tools too. They have the bright orange cords. Um, I found this one and it has a great, see that black component? This, once it's screwed into your camera, and if you were on a large studio set and someone tripped on it, it's gonna stay secure to your camera, which is a great feature. So this is how you set it up. On my camera, so look at your specs to see what type of cord you need. This is a USB 3.0. You'll also look for your USB port on the side of your camera. So I move this over. I first plug this into the slot. So I plug that in. Then I slide this down over it. And I use this section here and I screw it into the camera. And now it's really secure. Okay, that's all set. A little more, make sure it's flush. Okay, all right, so then I now take the other part of the cord and add it into the side of my laptop at the USB. All right, so now Lightroom. So you want to direct all the pictures that you take onto either a portable drive, which I do for my clients, or on your actual laptop, but I would recommend having it on your portable drive. So once you go into, move this forward for you. Once you go into Lightroom, you'll go to File, and there's a section called Tethered Capture. And you will click on Start Tether Capture. You'll, and this is where you put the session name, the sequence, and where you want the information to go. If you want it to go on your drive, you'll choose your drive, find the folder, create a new folder. Now I choose that folder, so every picture I take, it's going to land in the portable drive under that folder. You can put keywords here, metadata information, and click OK. Now my camera's on, it's going to look for the camera, and this pops up. You know you have a connection once you see this window. Right here is my camera information. So you can see um, my Canon 5D Mark IV and my settings that I have set, the aperture, the ISO, my white balance. Now this is a nice feature. If my camera was set up on a tripod and I did not want any camera shake and I wanted to, you can adjust the aperture here, your ISO here. You can make the changes right here and then and the photo will, will pop into Lightroom. Now, once you're done, how do you disconnect? You go back to file, go back to tether capture, and now it says stop tether capture. You click on that, that black box goes away. It's now safe. Take the plugs away. Everything is on your drive already, and you're all set up. Hope this helps. Bye.